A good retirement planning must consider many factors, including safety, economic stability, climate, healthcare system, and lifestyle offered by the country where you want to live. Many European countries offer economically enticing benefits for individuals who wish to spend their retirement there. Some of these countries are also rich in natural and artistic beauty, along with a social environment suitable for older individuals. In this video, we aim to introduce you to the 10 best European countries to retire in. We hope to provide you with some useful ideas for your retirement planning. Please read the description carefully to understand the sources of our information. Number 10. Finland. Let's start with the negative aspects. In Finland, it's cold. In Helsinki, during February, the average temperature ranges from 19 to 28 degrees Fahrenheit, or from minus 7 to minus 2 degrees Celsius. The cost of living is high, 22% more than in the United States. Another issue may be the long hours of daylight in summer or darkness in winter. On the other hand, Finland has been considered the happiest nation in the world for many years. It has a strong economy, and retirees can rely on a high-quality healthcare system. Additionally, it is a safe country, with bicycle and car thefts decreasing since the early 2000s. Three quarters of Finns speak English, and financially, although the cost of living is high, rents are lower compared to other wealthy European countries. In the city center, you can find a one-bedroom apartment for $880, while the same apartment can cost $710 outside the city center. If you want to buy a house, know that interest rates on home loans in Finland are among the lowest in the Eurozone. In Finland, you live in close contact with nature. There's a law that allows people to walk, camp, fish, and freely participate in other outdoor recreational activities throughout the beautiful Finnish nature. Finland is a desirable destination for those with a high pension and for those seeking tranquility, social stability, safety, and a strong connection with nature, especially for those who are not afraid of the cold. Number 9. Germany. The climate in Germany is certainly better than that in Finland, although not as favorable as in some other countries on this list. The cost of houses is quite high, and taxes in Germany can be a sensitive point in retirement planning. In Germany, individuals are taxed based on their income, with tax rates ranging from 14% to 45% for incomes exceeding $305,700. However, rent is approximately 37% lower than in the United States. A one-bedroom apartment in the city center can cost you up to $1,480 in a city like Munich and as low as $650 in a city like Leipzig. For this reason, only half of the residents in Germany own a home. The cost of living is not particularly high, at least compared to other wealthy European countries and the United States and Canada. The average monthly budget you'll need in Germany excluding rent, ranges from $700 to $850. But there are many reasons that have made this country the preferred destination for many retirees. There is an excellent healthcare system, and the infrastructure is excellent and well maintained. The natural and artistic wonders are unique in the world. The country is well connected to nine other wonderful neighboring nations. It's not the ideal country for those who love the sea, and there are certainly other nations where you can save more. But for everything else, Germany is becoming increasingly one of the preferred destinations for many retirees. Number 8. Cyprus. Cyprus is one of the favorite destinations for retirees for several reasons. Firstly, the climate is wonderful, with 300 sunny days a year and sea water temperatures that can reach 32 degrees Celsius or 90 degrees Fahrenheit. However, it should be noted that some cities can be very hot and humid, so many retirees prefer to live along the coast. But what also motivates many retirees to move here are the economic advantages, and we know that this is a crucial aspect in retirement planning. The cost of living is much lower compared to other European countries, including housing. For instance, you can find a lovely two-bedroom apartment in a furnished complex with a pool, just a 10-minute drive from the sea, for 500 euros per month. If you want to buy a house, you can find them for 80,000 or 120,000 euros. Taxes are also very low. Cyprus imposes a maximum tax rate of 5% on pension income and offers reduced VAT on property purchases. Cyprus is an island divided in two. 
In the northern part of the island, there is the Turkish Republic of Northern Cyprus, with beautiful cities like Famagusta and North Nicosia. This part is separated from the rest of the island by a buffer zone under the control of the UN. You don't need to worry, as the situation between the two parts of the island is much more relaxed than in the past. In fact, this island enjoys a low crime rate and offers flavorful and healthy cuisine. The sea is magnificent, and the beaches and cliffs are of breathtaking beauty. Number 7. Slovenia. Slovenia is among the safest countries in the world. This small nation boasts beautiful hills and mountains, small well-equipped and human-sized cities, breathtaking landscapes and lakes, and even a lovely strip of coastline on the Mediterranean Sea. Moreover, it's close and well-connected to other stunning neighboring nations. This country has a good and reasonably priced healthcare system. You can find private health insurance for less than $300 per month, and dental care is more affordable compared to other European countries. The cost of living is not high. As a rough comparison, it's about 45% less than in the United States, while rental prices are on average 190% lower than in the United States. A one-bedroom apartment in the center of Ljubljana, for example, costs an average of $645 per month, and even less if you go outside the city. If taxes are an important aspect of your retirement planning, you should know that income taxes range from 16% to 50%, depending on an individual's income. The downsides are that the local language is quite challenging to learn, but many people, especially the young and urban residents, also speak English. Another feature that may not appeal to everyone is the absence of large cities. So, if you prefer the bustling environment of a place like Paris or London, Slovenia might not be for you. But if you choose to spend your retirement in a beautiful, tranquil, and welcoming place, Slovenia awaits you. Number 6. France. France boasts immense natural, cultural, and landscape diversity. Here, you can find cities and villages that are authentic hidden treasures. The cuisine is excellent, and the healthcare system is among the best in the world, as well as very affordable. A typical visit to the doctor ranges from $10 to $30. As a resident, you will receive a 70% reimbursement of healthcare costs. France is very well connected to the rest of Europe and offers an excellent public transportation system. On the downside, some rankings claim that Paris is a very rude city, but we believe that reality is more complex. In any case, the rest of France is generally described as welcoming and friendly. The situation is similar regarding safety. Paris is not particularly safe, but in the rest of France, the situation changes drastically. The cost of living is not among the lowest compared to the mentioned nations, but rents are 41% lower than in the United States. Naturally, this does not apply to Paris and a few other large cities. Regarding economic benefits for retirees, if you have a company pension, you can benefit from a flat tax of 7.5% with an uncapped 10% allowance. France is the ideal country for those who don't want to miss anything, be it the sea and mountains, cities and villages, excellent cuisine, and magnificent art. Number 5. Malta. The Republic of Malta is located in the middle of the Mediterranean Sea and is composed of three main islands. The sea is truly stunning, and the climate is pleasant, although summers are hot and humid. The people are very welcoming and speak English well, so you won't have a hard time integrating and making friends. Malta has a government-subsidized public healthcare system and has been ranked by the World Health Organization as the fifth best healthcare system in the world. The cost of living is nearly 40% lower than in the United States, and housing costs are also relatively low. For example, you can find a two-bedroom apartment located between Bugiba and St. Paul's Bay, near all amenities but without a sea view, for around $176,000. In your retirement planning, you should consider that to obtain permanent residency, you must have a net worth of at least $39,500 or earn an annual income of at least $26,000. Regarding taxes, Malta imposes a fixed rate of 15% on retirees moving from abroad. Malta is one of the most densely populated countries in Europe, yet it is a state with good security. If you are looking for a quieter place, we recommend going to Gozo, one of the three main islands. Other lively but wonderful places to live a retired life are Slima, St. Julian's, Cora, and Maliha. 
Number 4. Greece. This beautiful country enjoys 250 days of sunshine per year and mild winters. The food is tasty and healthy, and it is a country with incredible natural, historical, and artistic beauty. Greek culture is characterized by respect and inclusion of the elderly. On the downside, English is not widely known, except by the younger generation and in tourist areas. The cost of living is quite affordable, almost 23% lower than in the United States. 2,000 euros per month, including rent, is enough to live comfortably in Athens, and even less if you choose to move to a rural area. As for housing, you can rent a one-bedroom apartment in the center of Athens for less than $500, while you can buy a house on the fabulous island of Crete for around $283,000. Greece offers a favorable tax system for retirees who transfer their tax residence, with a flat rate of 7% on all their pension income. Given the economic crisis that Greece faced a few years ago and that still has repercussions, if you have planned to work there before retiring, we recommend that you thoroughly research the job opportunities available today. But if you decide to move to Greece as a retiree, know that this country can truly offer for you, especially if you seek contact with nature, a welcoming atmosphere, a good climate, and a variety of leisure activities both outdoors and in the city. Number 3. Spain. Spain is an increasingly popular choice for retirees worldwide, especially among Brits and Germans. They can enjoy a splendid climate with four well-defined seasons, excellent and healthy cuisine, and countless natural, scenic, and architectural wonders. All of this contributes to a high quality of life for residents in Spain. The country is also renowned for its vibrant social life, where people of all ages gather in squares and venues in the evenings. Boredom is practically impossible in Spain. For those planning their retirement, it's good to know that the cost of living is relatively low, about 34% less than in the United States. However, the South is more economical than the North. In general, retiring comfortably in Spain with around $25,000 a year is possible, $20,000 if you're away from cities. Public health care is good, and if you opt for private, insurance costs range from $200 to $300 per month, including basic dental services. Property taxes are low, with a two-bedroom apartment in Alicante costing around $150,000 and on the Costa del Sol at $163,000. Renting a one-bedroom apartment in the city center averages $736, $603 if outside the center. Of course, Madrid and Barcelona are more expensive. Falling in love with Spain and its welcoming people is inevitable, making it a fantastic destination for retirees. Number 2. Italy. Italy is a wonderful country, renowned for its delicious food, stunning cities and villages, and a climate with four well-defined seasons. Italians are welcoming people who have the ability to make you feel at home. The cost of living is higher compared to some previously discussed countries, but there's a significant difference between the North and the South, which is decidedly more affordable. However, healthcare in the South doesn't match the quality of the North, which is top-notch, although the South and Islands enjoy a milder climate and longer life expectancy. The country is relatively safe, but safety varies greatly from city to city and region to region. Regarding housing costs, they have increased after the pandemic. It's higher compared to other countries we've seen and varies widely depending on the region. You could find a two-bedroom apartment on the Adriatic coast for just $170,000 or a beautiful two-bedroom apartment on Lake Como for $1.5 million. But in Italy, there are some municipalities selling houses for just one euro to encourage people to move. We are actually preparing a video on this topic, showcasing Italian and European municipalities adopting this initiative. If you're interested, subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell to catch when this video is released. And if you like this video, it would mean a lot to us if you give it a thumbs up. Thank you. Returning to houses in Italy and talking about rental costs, for a one-bedroom apartment in the city center, you can expect to pay around $720 per month. The same apartment located outside the city center would cost about $560, but it really depends on the cities and whether you're living in the north or south. If you're considering moving to Italy in your retirement planning, there's good news. The country imposes a flat rate of only 7% on foreign pensions for the first 10 years. 
To benefit from this advantage, you'll need to choose to live in some cities in southern Italy. Italy is an ideal country for those seeking culture, good food, beautiful landscapes, and a vibrant social life, although it's worth noting that English is not generally spoken by the elderly. Number 1. Portugal Portugal is often described as one of the best places in the world to retire, but things are about to change. Stay with us to find out why. First and foremost, a highly positive aspect of this country is its incredibly welcoming people. The Portuguese make you feel at home even if you don't speak their language well. It's also worth noting that it's not difficult to find someone who speaks English in Portugal, especially on the coast and in major cities. However, its healthcare system falls short compared to others mentioned in this video. Non-EU citizens must wait five years and apply for permanent residency to access free healthcare. Private insurance is advisable before that. The cost of living is favorable, 29% lower than the USA. In a small town, $2,000 allows a luxurious lifestyle. Rent for a one-bedroom apartment in the center of Lisbon is around $1,000, considerably less outside urban areas. The price of houses varies significantly depending on the area. For example, you can find a two-bedroom apartment in the center of a city in Algarve for $240,000 and a house with a pool for approximately $180,000 in Leiria. At the time of publishing this video, there is a 10% tax on pensions in Portugal following habitual residence for 10 years. But, as we mentioned earlier, things are about to change. Starting from January 1, 2024, these tax benefits will no longer be applicable, and those planning to move to Portugal must be aware that they will face significantly higher taxes compared to retirees who relocate by 2023. Nevertheless, Portugal remains and will continue to be a fantastic destination to peacefully and happily spend your retirement. But if economic considerations are crucial for you, you might be wondering if there are other European countries that offer great advantages to retirees deciding to move there. Indeed, that's exactly what we want to talk to you about in our final bonus. In Europe, there are two countries that provide complete exemption from taxes on pensions. Therefore, if a retiree moves here, they won't pay taxes on their foreign pension. One of these countries is Slovakia. Slovakia, nestled in Central Europe, boasts breathtaking landscapes, historic castles, and a rich cultural heritage. Bratislava, its capital, harmoniously blends medieval charm with modern vitality. The other country where foreign retirees do not pay taxes is Albania. Nestled in the Balkans, Albania boasts stunning landscapes, rich history, and warm hospitality. From ancient ruins to pristine beaches, Albania's allure captivates visitors with its diverse charm and cultural treasures. These two countries aim to emerge as ideal destinations for retirees coming from abroad. And you, where do you prefer to spend your retirement? Write it in the comments. And since the safety of a country is undoubtedly a very important factor to consider, we recommend checking out our video dedicated to the 10 safest countries in Europe. Well, that's it for today. Until next time.